Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel where we try to seek the good. I hope all of you are having a nice day, and today I'm going to tell you guys about the one good thing that happened in my day to make my day better. And the first good thing that had happened was, uh, I knew my wife was going to have to be working late tonight. She uh, had like an event to do at the university that uh, she had to be there for, um, and that meant I would have several hours just me and Domino um, hanging out. But I also knew how I was going to really fill up that time because on Monday, DB Geek, the YouTuber, uh, had uh, uploaded his final video for his Kingdom Hearts 2 playthrough. And this was significant for me because growing up, Kingdom Hearts 2 was one of my favorite games. And I would just like save certain spots of the game and then whenever I was bored, just like go back and replay that um, part again and just like relive that experience. And that was a good portion of my childhood growing up. So what I've really liked about D DB Geek and just watching him is that I've gotten to watch him play a lot of games that uh, I, I used to play as well, but because he hasn't played them, I get to like re-visit um, those like first time emotions through him. And it's been really good for Kingdom Hearts 2 because I already know what to expect, but I can also see that reaction as well and kind of like live that through him again. And uh, he got to finish the, uh, the game today. Um, well, for me today, he got to finish it. He probably finished it a little bit ago, according to the end of the video he's working on, uh, taking on some of the super bosses now. But um, I just got to see some of his reactions, his frustrations with some of the uh, harder bosses, which I know which ones he's talking about, and uh, some of the, like, the more emotional moments that hit him. And it was something that, towards the end, um, it was like getting me a little bit, like I was feeling myself kind of becoming choked up a bit, just like because the nostalgia was getting to me a bit. Uh, much there at the end, but I thought I had successfully choked it down there to, um, Whenever it came to the credits and he was given his review of the game Domino like jumped up on me and was like looking at me at the, in the face and I was like giving him a little face rub and I was like uh, Just talking to him and I was like I meant to say this game means a lot to me and what came out was this game <laughs> because I choked up and started sobbing right then and there because it just ended up getting to me. And it was a good cry. I wasn't like sad or anything. It was just like, I didn't realize how much it would affect me. Uh, I like, again, this one of my favorite games growing up, but it was just really nice to really revisit that. So thank you to DB Geek allowing me to see that uh, through him again. Um, if he ever watches this video, I hope he knows how much uh, that really meant to me and how much that has the, uh, his similar playthroughs have been to other people so yeah I just wanted to go ahead and say that and just talk about the good things that I got from uh, watching the end of this playthrough so good things there and that'll actually do it for the uh, video today so thank you guys so much for watching if you have any good things that happened in your day please feel free to share down in the comments below so we can continue to share the good things that happen all around us and if you don't feel comfortable with that that's okay I hope you'll consider taking something positive away from these videos to make your day just a little bit better. Also, if you like the video or like any of the content on the channel, I hope you'll consider liking and subscribing just so we can keep up with future good things that happen in general. And with all that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you continue to have a nice day, and this has been Seek the Good. Goodbye!